Good morning, good evening, good night, wherever you are. Today, I've got some more exciting information, and that is you can now record yourself and your screen directly in Canva. So let's dive into Canva and have a look. For those of you that are new here, my name's Darren Meredith. I'm a Canva certified creative and Canva creator. And on this channel, I do a lot of things that are Canva related and also help you with your content creation. So if that's something you're into, don't forget to click like and subscribe down below. But let's get into today's tutorial where I'm gonna show you how you can now record your screen and yourself at the same time directly in Canva. Now this is gonna be really good for things like if you wanna pre-record a presentation or if you wanna pre-record kind of like a tutorial, a bit like what I'm doing here. It's not quite as advanced when it comes to the editing side, but you are gonna have some editing options so like you'll be able to cut it, add in their screenshots and things like that, and add in multiple layers of audio and things like that but you can't split out the audio or and you can't have kind of like picture in picture of kind of like screenshots so if i wanted to pop something up like this then you wouldn't be able to kind of like see that within canva however let's take a look and show you exactly what you can do in the actual new screen recording so here we are we're in a we're in canva and this is just one of my many free accounts so i'm going to create a design now to see these options you have to click on video now it has to be a video option in order to be able to kind of like show you these things that are available so once we're here we're in a it's a 1080p video if you want a higher resolution you're going to have to look at doing something else externally in order to be able to do this but in canva you can come over and you can click on videos and then you can see this option here that says record yourself and once you click on hit record yourself you then get this screen here now this screen here is showing all sorts of different strange things we've got three icons at the top here so we've got a microphone and this is going to choose the right whichever microphone i want to choose on here so i'm going to choose the uh let's choose this one see there you go so once i've chosen an actual microphone that's now got some audio you can see that it's got some kind of like signal because it's showing up the information here next we're going to look at video and I'm going to look, I can't choose this one because my Mac's closed over there. So I'm going to close, choose this one, which is actually the same as this one that's recording this. So I don't know if this is going to work, but we're going to give it a try. And then what we've got is we've got this option here. Now I can record just camera only or camera of the, the camera that's recording me. And I can also share my screen. So if I click on share screen, I've got a second screen. So I've got two monitors here. And I nearly knocked over my water bottle there, but it's fine. So I've got two monitor screens here. So this is the screen that you're seeing here with this up. And this is my second screen. So I want to record this screen here that you're, show, that you're seeing. I can also choose a different window. So if I've got different tabs open and also different Chrome tabs as well that I can have open. So I'm going to show it my entire screen and I'm going to choose screen one. So it's going to be this screen here. Because you see that, you get kind of like this bit of an, an inception kind of like look. So, and it says that it's now sharing. And now all I need to do is I need to just hit the record option. So if I click on record, it's going to give me a little bit of a countdown. And there we go. I'm now recording this screen. So this is the actual screen that I'm recording. And it doesn't have to be something that's camera related. I could bring in something else that's not camera related so I could go on to a different website if you like so if I wanted to go to my own website here better content creators I could then show the screen here and show you through that and that will then once I've closed that that then will it'll all be recording in the background you could see it kind of like disappear in the background there again if I want I did want to show you Canva I could come on and I could go to all my Canva screen and go and create click create a design I want to create an Instagram post and let's say it's just taking its moment so I've got some different Instagram posts here and I want motivation motivation quotes so I wanted this one I really like this one it's a Canva Pro video I forget I'm on Canva free this is my one of my Canva free accounts um, if you do want to try Canva Pro free i've got a 45 day trial down below normally you can only get it for 14 days try for 14 days i always thought it was 30 but 
you can try it free for 14 days if you do it this way however i'll put a link down below in the description so you can actually try canva pro free for 45 days and if you've got any questions about using the pro options let me down know down in the comments it can be on this video or any one of my videos and i'll always try and help you with your questions on canva pro and also down in the comments you'll see a link to my facebook group called better content creators so i'll put a link down there and you can always jump in there and ask me any questions and i'll try and help you the best i can let's just choose a free template so i'm just going to click this one spring is here and i want to change that so i want to come in i want to change that and i want to say summer is here I know that it's more spring because it's blossom but there you go so i'm showing you how you can come in you can double click here and i'm showing you the template and then once i've done that i need to come back to the one you'll see it's got this little red icon on here so i know that that's recording and i can either pause the video so i can pause and then do something else and then come back to record or if i'm happy with the recording i can then click done now once i click done i need to click then save and exit over here now once i click save and exit it's actually going to put that into my upload section over here and you can there see I'm now, recording this. I'm now recording this so there we go that's that's that and i can then come here and then say set video as background and in here i can also move myself around so this is the actual separate screen that it created and i can move that around I can come in here and as I'm watching it, I can choose to split the screen. Can I choose to split the screen? Yeah, I can choose to split. So if I wanted to put in something else there, I could do. I can come over and I can add in audio options. So I can either upload my own audio um, or I can choose some of the audio that's in Canva. If you use Canva Pro, there are some more options in there. I personally don't use the audio directly from Canva. I use Epidemic Sound and I'll put a link down below to Epidemic Sound for a free trial for that for 30 days. Um, and I'm, I'm an Epidemic Sound ambassador myself, but Epidemic Sound is something that I've used for years, even before I came an ambassador. So do check that out. Check out the link down below. So th there's all the links down below. And yeah, I think that's everything. Just kind of like have a go, have a play about with it, record your screen. You could record a presentation, so it could be a presentation that you're recording for for something to send it off to somewhere. Um, you could even use it to kind of like test if you wanted, so or like practice doing kind of presentations or presenting your screen to somebody. You could just come in, record yourself and then watch it back. And I can guarantee you, if you watch your own recording back, the first few times you do it, you won't like the sound of your voice. You'll think you hesitate, you pause, you say all the wrong words. I say all the wrong words in all my videos still. So, you know, but it's something that kind of like can help with your presentation skills or getting better on your presentation skills. So that's recording your screen and recording yourself directly within Canva really great new addition to canva and it's available for free users and pro free users see i nearly bumbled my own words there it's available for free users and canva pro users and down below i will put a link to the 45 day trial if you want to try the canva pro options as you can see most of the audio is only available for canva pro so do check that out and if you've got any questions on this or any of my other videos, drop them down in the comments below. And until next time, thank you very much. Bye for now.